Hey, good morning. Chuck here with Apple Drains. Today, let's learn how to reset the tire pressure monitoring system. It is really easy. I promise you, you can do this. Let's take a look. The first thing we do is we turn on the vehicle. We don't start it, just put it in the on position. Let your computer come on. Notice it says tire pressure, or sorry, service tire monitoring system. And you can see that annoying little flashing light over there that doesn't go off until you reset the system. The way that we set that is over here on the left hand side, there is a system of buttons. We're going to go to the information button, second one down, and we push that until we get to where it says press the check button to relearn tire positions. Okay? Check button is down here at the bottom. And when I press this, it signals the computer in the truck to start relearning uh, the tire pressure systems of each tire, and it does it one at a time. So let's go ahead and press this check button. It'll beep twice. That tells me that we're ready to check the tire system. Okay, it has two chirps, tells me that the system is active, and you can see this light is lit up, driver's front. We let some air out. Hopefully the computer will now learn the code of this valve stem and record it for the driver's front. When it does learn it, this light goes off, it'll beep one time. Okay, there's our chirp. Moving on to the next one. Notice that the passenger front light is lit, telling me it's going to learn this tire. Let the air out. Only about five seconds. Just long enough for the tire, the computer to notice that the tire is changing. Once it notices that, it will record and save it into the dash. Terrific, we've got two tires saved. Let's run around to the back of the truck real quick. Notice that the passenger rear light is now lit up. Let's let some air out. We're waiting on the chirp. Hopefully the computer learns that tire. I'm going to let some more. Okay, notice that that was a single chirp and that now our driver's rear light is lit up. I'm going to turn the camera a little bit. We're going to let the air out of this tire for five seconds. If it learns this, it'll beep twice and we're done. Sometimes you have to repeat the process, which is not great, but we're after resetting that tire pressure monitoring system, so it's pretty great. Two beeps, two chirps. I believe we have this. Let's go take a look at the dash. Okay, so you can see that we've got our air pressure close to the same gauge in the rear. In the fronts, up there also. But the most important thing is, <laughs> Notice that the tire pressure monitoring system gauge is now off. So we've solved this problem. Hey, this is Chuck with Apple Drains reminding you that if you believe you can do something, I guarantee you can do it. Have a great day.